Hey everybody, it is Scorch here once again with another MLP FIM commentary. Now, before I begin with today's episode, which is Griffin to brush off, I would like to make a little announcement regarding the currently going Season 5. Yes, whenever an episode of Season 5 premieres, I will be doing a blind commentary for that episode. So you should expect the first blind episode to be tomorrow. And it's funny, tomorrow's episode involves Griffin's. Today's episode involves griffins, and rumor has it tomorrow could involve a certain griffin, so this is all relevant. But without further ado, let's get this going right about now. Hot flagging action overload! She was like a stunt superstar, flying higher and higher, and then Rainbow Dash swooped down, swoosh, and right before she hit the ground, shoom, she pulled up! Uh-huh. And then she looked around and around like, woo, 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 woo. Uh -huh. Pinky down. We have a pinky down. Phew. A rainbow dash! Uh, Pinkie Pie? Not again. <laughs> Run, rainbow, rainbow, rainbow dash. dash. Run while you still can. Now, Pinkie Pie. But, but rainbow dash? I'm in the middle of something. But I said not now. He was just trying to tell you about the cliff. Oh, hold that thought. Ah, yeah, close enough. She'll never find me up here. Hi! I'm looking for Rainbow Dash. Have you seen her? Hello, Derpy. Hi there. Have you seen Rainbow Dash? Okay. Isn't she right up there? Rainbow Dash! <laughs> Twilight, you gave away your best friend. Phew. That was close. Hi! <laughs> Run all you want, Rainbow Dash. You can't hide from the pinky pie. Does beginning to remind me where the inspiration for a certain MLP story came from? <laughs> I need a favor, Rainbow Dash. Wow, she's good. Oh, forget it. I totally promise it will be totally fun. <sighs> okay. <laughs> hmm. Maybe a few inches to the south. And now a couple centimeters north. Okay. One more smidge meter to the Pinkie Pie! Uh, I mean, perfect. Now wait for my What about making it go weast? <laughs> Theme song drop. Stop. You gave him hiccups. MLP equivalent of spam. Oh, okay. Good. Pretty <laughs> much the same thing. More two of scrolls. Nope. 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 That one. Have you ever seen anything more hilarious? <laughs> I can think of one thing. <laughs> <laughs> Scares equal hiccup. I thought it was the other way around. I didn't take you for a prankster, Pinkie Pie. Are you kidding? I love to pull pranks. It's all in good fun, and Pinkie Pie loves 
funny, I just noticed. This is the first episode to involve griffins and revolves around Rainbow Dash and Pinkie Pie. What I know about tomorrow's episode, which today is the date I'm recording this, Friday, May 22nd. Tomorrow's episode involves griffins and also involves Rainbow Dash and Pinkie Pie. Is she even home? I don't know. <laughs> there she is. Oh, <laughs> uh, good old harmless pranks. Oh, hey. Good old harmless fun. Nobody's getting hurt. <gasps> I want these apples, and I want them now. Okay, this just shows that these two have too much time on their hands. Oh, this game well. I don't think I'm anywhere about that, turtle. Is someone over there? Who are we gonna squirt? Who are we gonna squirt? <laughs> Fluttershy. What? No, 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 no. We can't prank Fluttershy. I mean, she's so sensitive. It'll hurt her feelings. Even our most harmless prank. Yeah, you're right. Huh. We need another victim who's made of tougher stuff. So, <laughs> who's it gonna be? Well, uh... <laughs> I would like to tell you, but. <laughs> around. Oh, awesome! Who, who? Do I know them? <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> You're very close. <laughs> Good one, Pinkie Pie. <laughs> Too slow. See where you're going. Rise and shine, Rainbow Dash. It's a brand new day, and we got a lot of pranking kids. Ooh. Morning, Pink. Gilda, this is my gal pal, Pinkie Pie. Introducing Gilda hey, the Griffin, aka this is my one of Gilda. the most Griffin? hated characters in the show. Uh, awesome. Actually, at the moment, I can think of only two characters who are more hated Gilda's than my best Gilda, my and those would be um, um, hey, so remember the chant? Down tiara. Shuh, they made us recite it every morning. I'll never get that lame thing out of my head. So... Come on. Only for you, Do Dash. it. Junior speedsters are our lives. Skybound swords and daring dives. Junior speedsters, it's our quest to someday be the very best. <laughs> I groove on a good prank as much as the next Griffin. But Dash, you promised me we'd get a flying session in this morning. Yeah, uh, well, Pinkie Pie, hmm. you don't mind, do you? Gilda just got here. We'll catch up with you later. Oh, um, well, sure, no problem. Have fun, you guys. I'll, uh, just catch up with you. <sighs> later. Medina. Uh-oh. I feel bad. Trampoline so wasn't there. Random. Yeah, what am I kidding? I like, actually like Pinkie Pie. Hey Dash, think you got I enough like gas left to beat me to her. that cloud? A race? You are so on! One, two, three, go! Hey! I win! As if I won, dude! No way! Yes way! Oh, come on! I was uh -uh. way ahead of you! I don't think so. Oh, three, there is no I... way you beat me. <laughs> Whatever. Well, guys, that was 
I can say she was inspired by a certain Disney movie. One of that cloud up there is a gnarly dragon egg. Go! Uh -oh. I think my altitude is making you dizzy. Oh, that was just extremely uncalled for. Wow! You guys almost got away from me that time. <laughs> Apparently, she will not take so, no Dad, for an answer. You got any new moves in your trictionary, or are you 100% old school? New mm. moves? Take a walk. Hey, Pinky, come here. Yeah? Don't you know how to take get lost for an answer? Dash doesn't need to hang with a dweeb like you now that I'm around. You're dorking up the sky, stinky pie. So make like a bee. Buzz off! Mayday, mayday. We're going yeah. down. Hey, where's Pinkie Pie in her crazy contraption? Uh, she left. Something about being as busy as a bee. Okay, I'm pretty sure Pinky did not invent that. Someone else did. So, Pinkie Pie, are you sure that this friend of Rainbow Dash is really so mean? Um, yeah! She keeps stealing Rainbow Dash away, she popped my balloons, and she told me to buzz off! I've never met a Griffin this mean. Well, actually, I've never met a Griffin at all. But I bet if I had, she wouldn't have been as mean and grumpy as Oh, Bilba. just wait till tomorrow. You know what I think, Pinkie Pie? Well, I think you're jealous. Jealous? Yes, Twilight. Tell your friend who you've known a lot longer that well, she's jealous. Yes. Despite jealous. the fact it's painfully Listen, obvious that Gilda, 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 Gilda is a B-I-T-C-H. I mean, perhaps it's you, Pinky, who needs to improve her attitude. Improve my attitude? But I... But it's Gilda that... Are you serious? Ugh. <sighs> Twilight is right. No, she's, she's not. not. A big, mean, grumpy, mean, meanie pants. Maybe I'm just a big, jealous, judgmental, jealous. Pinky, jealous you're pants. not. You're totally in the right here. <laughs> that was sweet. Ugh. I gotta take care of a few weather jobs around here. Shouldn't take long. Just uh, hang out in town and I'll come find you. That's cool, I guess. I'm gonna go chow down. Later. Ah, a rattler! A rattler! Run for the hills! Everybody run! Save yourselves! Oh, take your time. This stuff ain't fresh, dude. Aw, poor Granny Smith! She didn't know it was a joke! How mean! No, no, I can't misjudge her. It was Pinky, kind of funny you're friend. not misjudging. Yes? Pinky, you're it's not misjudging her. Uh -oh. This way, this way. Mama Duck, you're free and clear. Hey! Oh, please excuse me. I'm walking here! Oh, I'm, I'm and sorry. here comes the reason everyone sorry, hates Gil. Why don't you just watch where you're going, doofus? But, but, but I. I. <gasps> And that's the reason I will forever hate Gilda. Uh, please, all these lame ponies are driving me buggy. I gotta bail. She's a grump and a thief and a bully. The meanest kind of mean meanie pants there is. Language, Pinkie Pie. Language. No one treats Fluttershy like that. No one. This calls for extreme measures. Pinkie Pie style. That can't be good. Yes, because when I think of revenge, I think of throwing a party. Gilda have her nothing about? I hear she's an old friend of Rainbow Dash, a griffin, so rare. You've met Gilda, right? What's she like? Oh, um, well, I'll tell you later, Twilight. Welcome! Welcome! Um, Pinkie Pie, about this party for Gilda, um, do you really think it's a good idea? I mean... Don't worry your pretty little head about mean old Gilda. Your Auntie Pinkie Pie's got it all taken care of. 
I'm a year older than you. Hey, that's probably the only suggestion other than Rainbow Dash's upcoming birthday party in Season 4 that we will ever get to age. I still have no idea how, to, how old these ponies are. Hmm, shocking development. <laughs> oh, Pinkie Pie, the old hoop shake buzzer. You are a scream. Yeah, <laughs> good one, Pinkie Pie. Come on, G. I'll introduce you to some of my other friends. Right behind you, Dash. I know what you're up to. Great. They don't. I know what you're planning. <laughs> well, I hope so. Gilda, like she is immune party. to your logic. I mean, I've got my eye on you. And I got my eye on you. Everyone, I'd like you all to meet Gilda, a longtime dear friend of Rainbow Dash. Let's honor her and welcome her to Ponyville. Grab your torches and pitchforks. Please help yourself. Vanilla lemon drops. Don't mind if I do. Hi! Gee, the punch! <laughs> huh? Oh. Well, what do you know? Pepper and the vanilla lemon drops and the punch served in a dribble glass. <laughs> Priceless. Priceless. <laughs> <laughs> yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> yeah, hilarious. Hey, it gee, is. look! Presents! We haven't even, we don't even know you! What are we gonna get you? <laughs> Spittin' snakes! <laughs> Some pony pulled that prank on me last month! Ha uh ha! -huh. Their age that meter is going was. up! You do? Take time, every pony! Hey, can I blow up the candles? Why don't we let Gilda blow out the candle, Spike? She is the guest of honor, after all. Exactly! <gasps> uh, <gasps> I guess you could say she's just full of hot air. <laughs> Relighting birthday candles! I love that prank! What a classic! Now I wonder who could have done that! Yeah, I wonder. Starts whistling innocently. Who cares? This cake is amazing! Spike? What? It's great! Try some! Hey, G, you're not upset about some silly candles, are you? No way, Dash. Like I said, I'm down with a good prank. Come on, then. Let's have some cake. Where are you running to? It's right there. Hey, I'm watching you like a hawk. Why? Can't you watch me like a griffin? Hey y'all, it's Pin the Tail. Don't you just love how any of your friends Let's weren't noticing play. this? Oh, my favorite game. Can I go first? Can I have the purple tail? Oh, well, I am the guest of honor, and I'll have the purple tail. And you yeah, are you royal biatch. Let's get you blindfolded. Hey, what are you doing? Around, around, around they go. Where'd I stop? Pinky by nose. Now just walk straight ahead and pin the tail. Now just walk straight ahead and pin the tail. <laughs> yeah, right. This is another prank, isn't it? I'm going this way. Oh, wait! The poster uh, this For way. once, she was uh, being honest here. Uh, Gilda? You pinned the tail on the wrong end. <laughs> <laughs> Are she blows. Is your idea of a good time? I've never met a lamer bunch of dweebs in all my life. And Pinkie Pie, you! You are Queen Lamo with your weak little party pranks. Did you really think you could make me lose Hating my Hating her goal? more. Well, Dash Hating her more. Ten times Hating her more. Hating her more. Come on, Dash. We're bailing on this pathetic scene. Come on, Rainbow Dash. I said we're leaving. You know, Gilda? I was the one who set up all those weak pranks at this party. What the twist? What? Ooh. So I guess I'm Queen Lamo. Come on, Dash. You're joshing me. They weren't all meant for you specifically. It was just dumb luck that you set them all off. I should have known. <laughs> sure, dumb luck. <laughs> right. No way. It, it was Pinkie Pie. She set up this party to trip me up, to make a fool of me. Me? I threw this party to improve your attitude. I thought a good party might turn that frown upside down. And you sure didn't need any help making a fool of yourself. 
You know, this is not how I thought my old friends would treat my new friends. If being cool is all you care about, maybe you should go find some new cool friends someplace else. Mm. Yeah? Well, oh, you, you, it. you are such a, a flip-flop. Cool one minute and lame oh, the next. You wow. don't have to be lame anymore. Nice Give comeback. Call. Not cool. Wow, talk about a party pooper. Wow, what was that about? Yeah, that was so really awkward. awkward. I'm sorry, every pony, for bringing Gilda here. I didn't know how rude she was. And Pinkie Pie, I'm really sorry she ruined that awesome party you put on for her. Hey, if you want to hang out with party poopers, that's your business. I'd rather hang out with you. No hard feelings? No hard feelings. Wait a minute. <laughs> What Pinky, to do sorry I accused you of misjudging Gilda. Looks like I'm the one who misjudged you. It's okay, Twilight. Even you can't be yeah. a super smart smarty smart pants all the time. Come on, every pony. There's still a whole lot of party to finish. <laughs> Dearest Princess Celestia, yeah. today I This that is what we call shoehorning. Twilight's being shoehorned into the moral so because. The overall problem with season one, out, she was the only one who could report the problem. Just continue and I believe they friend. fixed it with season In two. End, the difference between a false friend this is not the last time we're going to see her shoehorn the life. plot. Your faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. Dear Twilight Sparkle, my most faithful student. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Wrong ink! <sighs> Pranking royalty. That doesn't seem a bad idea. Alright, so that was Griffin the Brush Off. My overall opinion... I would consider it the first meh episode of Season 1. Because the biggest problem with it is Gilda. No one, and I mean no one, likes her. Well, I should take that back. There's, uh, She has a few fans. More fans than Diamond, Tiara, and Silver Spoon will ever get. It's just the problem that I noticed with the episode of watching it this time. Twilight is willing to believe that Pinky is jealous when, in all accounts, Pinky is right. She's in the right this episode. Gilda is a B I T C H. Overall, and uh, oh, I forgot that once more. Twilight was shoehorned into the end because she has nothing to do with the plot. She's just there, but she's the only one who can get the moral. Overall, it's a meh episode. I'd recommend it if you're starting out with the series. But until next time, guys, have a good night. Take care. Bye-bye.